Hello and welcome everybody, it's Gibby here. In this video, I'm gonna show you guys this little program called SCRCPY Plus. SCRCPY Plus is also free and open source and also works on Mac, Windows, Linux. It makes using SCRCPY easy, plus it has extra features for your phone. This is the official GitHub page for SCRCPY Plus. You can go here and just download it for Windows, Linux or Mac. This program is actually amazing because we can control our phone easily. I mean, we can still use the SCRCPY, but SCRCPY Plus just makes it easy. All right. And SCRCPY uh, comes with the SCRCPY Plus. So you don't have to download any separate file or anything like that. It's just all in one package. Okay. Uh, just easily control your phone from your PC just like that and you can also get your devices info model and Android version and everything and the extra feature that I was talking about are tools and ADB quick actions uh, in ADB quick actions uh, we can do physical keyboard settings we can press home button just in case your home button is broken actually <laughs> now new smartphones doesn't have any home button they it's all like touch uh, but still you can do that and you can also reboot your phone to bootloader if you want to customize your android phone maybe install custom rom or you know unlock a bootloader or something like that now in tools first option we have the package manager this is actually a debloater tool so if you want to debloat your phone you want to uninstall those system apps that you don't need uh, you can easily delete them there is actually better debloater tool and then this called universal debloater tool or something like that uh, at github i think i have also made a video on that but if you want to use this you can also use this but please uh, if you don't know how to debloat phone, if you don't know what package you are deleting, let's say for example, you want to uninstall the Facebook app because it was the system app and you can't uninstall it. So make sure that you delete the package name which resembles the same app that you're uninstalling. Sometimes it can be really confusing because the app name is different and the package name could be different. So uh, for most cases, it will be same. So let's say I want to uninstall Facebook. So it's com.facebook.katana. So this is like for sure a Facebook app. I can uninstall it. But if you don't know which app you're uninstalling, if you're not sure, then don't use this debloater tool or any debloater tool because you, you can break your device if you uninstall a system app, which is required to run a phone so be safe when you use this it's not like you can't recover your phone you can obviously flash the official firmware again but uh, if you don't know how to debloat if you're not sure then I'm pretty sure that you don't know how to recover your phone so yeah watch the tutorials uh, on YouTube before doing anything and make sure that you're deleting the right app next feature in tools is file manager here basically you can browse your phone's storage it is actually really useful if you connect uh, to the crcpy plus using wireless connection not usb then you know it's gonna be useful because <laughs> you got it right and so on there are some other uh, scrcpy related settings too that you can apply you can change the bitrate and everything else so basically this thing is yeah truly amazing <laughs> i said it twice i think uh, yeah actually really really good program easy to use plus makes easy to use a crcpy just connect your phone through usb or wireless uh, actually i'm gonna disconnect my phone here so you can see uh, you'll get a option connect wirelessly and in here you can input the ip address of your phone and Done. If you use SCRCPY to control your phone from your PC, I mean, just go for it. It's way better. I mean, it's still SCRCPY. I mean, there is no change about that, but it just makes using SCRCPY easier. That's all. And has some extra tools that you can use for your phone. That's it. Hope you enjoyed it. If you still have any questions, have any suggestions for me, you can always do the comment. Yeah. That's it. I will see you in the next one. Take care of yourself and have fun. Bye-bye.